Hey guys, it's Jermaine the Math Person. Today I'll be going over question 249 on SOA exam P. So pause the video real quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, assume you, you already attempted it, let's just dive right in. An actuary has done an analysis of all policies that cover two cars. They realize that 70% of policies are type A for both cars. So that means if there's two cars, both cars, oh, that's awful. If they have two cars, then both of those are um, policies. Th those are both of those are type A with a probability of 0.7 um, and 30% for the other car, which makes sense. Um, the number of claims on different cars across all policies are mutually independent. The distribution of the number of claims are given below. So this is 30% by the way. Four policies are selected at random. So if there's four policies that are selected at random, calculate the probability that exactly one of the four policy has the same number of claims on both cars. So what is the probability that exactly what is the probability that they have the same probability um they have the same number of claims? Well, we know for type A, if there's two cars, what is the probability that they're both they both have claim zero? Well, that's just equal to 0.4 times 0.4, right? And likewise, we can say that for the rest. So we can say for type A we can just multiply it down, so 0.4 times 0.4 plus 0.3 times 0.3 plus 0.2 times 0.2 times a plus 0.1 times 0.1. So this is with a probability of 0.3. And how about for type B? Well, for type B, if we have two cars that are both covered by type B, what is the probability that um, they will be the same number of claims? Well, that's just equal to 0.25 squared, like 0.25 times 0.25, but we know everything is just 0.25, so we can just times it 4 by 4, so that's 0.25 times 0.25 times 4, and again, this is like that, right? Yeah. Okay, so this is equal to 0.25, and again, this is equal to 0.3, but then we know that the 70% are point our type A, so we can just say 0.7 times 0.3 plus 0.25, or I can say 0.3 times 0.25, right? 30% of the type P cars. Okay, so this is equal to 0.285. Okay, so what is the probability that exactly one of those policies, one of the four policies, has the same number of claims? exactly four so exactly one out of the four so that's just four choose one the probability which is 0.285 to the one power um, and the complement of 285 which is just 0.715 to the third power what is this equal to this is equal to 0.41669 so that's approximately equal to 0.417 which is our answer d if you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!